All right, hello again. It's Evie from Cryogenic Evie, which is my channel, and that's why you're here, hopefully, to watch me play games. I'm very awkward. Still getting used to this shit. Um. <laughs> anyway, let us. Well, that was me jumping. Let us continue. Oh, well, this looks a lot better. Hmm. Ham, ham, ham. Locked. God damn it, I keep, <laughs> I keep jumping. All right, all right. Kinda like, well fine. If there's an emergency, we're gonna die. Yep, we're gonna die if there's an emergency. Oh, probably shouldn't go in here. I will not go in there just yet. Check every door. Ooh, fuck. Oh, uh, maybe I should go in this one first. Huh. What's this? This is a very loud room. This is, this is an intense amount of information going on right here. What if I turned it off? Can I do th nope. Nope. Nothing cool. Oh, that's like a power drill. Oh. Well, they're working on something, I guess. It's not for drilling brains. Oh. Uh, there's one- Oh, there's the- Mm-hmm. Yep, that would help. I'm smart. I'm super smart. Yo, I want that set up. I want this. Well, this is a whole bunch of information I have no idea what to do with. Awesome. All right. Moving on. Get the fuck out of my way door. Hi, dude. Oh, hi. Didn't yes. Hear you come in. Uh huh. Simon hi. Simon Jarrett, right? Doctor uh -huh. Muchi. Well, it's uh, just Mr. Muchi. But I'm working on it. Actually, you're helping me right now. Is cool. this part of your thesis work? Yeah. It's a study I'm doing with my colleague, Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction. Well, to help nice people you. like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes. Yes, I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. Okay, let me check the room first, because that's what normal people do. Can I read that? Mm-hmm. Yep. Everything looks in order. As I expected. Yep. Mm-hmm. Amazing. Amazing. So, what exactly are we doing? We're gonna do a scan of your brain. Then we build a computer model of it and bombard it with stimuli. The program will help us to quickly iterate your treatment plan until it's fully optimized. In short, develop the perfect treatment for your condition. So it's not just a study. This will actually help me. I should hope so. Otherwise, this would be a huge waste of time. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> ha. So much faith! You know, have a serious condition, right? You heard about the car crash, the X months to live deal? Yes, I heard. Must be hard having to hear that. As you know, it's because your brain is weakened so much that it can start to bleed every so often. And if it ever gets real bad, it will kill me. Well, we probably can't restore your brain completely. But we should be able to make those X months turn into years. Decades, even. If you take care of yourself and don't do anything too crazy, we should be able to get you to outlive the best of us. Mm-hmm. Sure. I really hope you're right about this. Me too. <laughs> this could make a huge difference for how we treat people with brain damage. So, what do you say? Should we get going? Sure. Let's get started. Take a seat. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try and like talk to everyone as much as possible and read every possible thing. Um, I tr I definitely like to play like that. So hopefully you enjoy trying to like get as much information as possible when you watch these things. So please have a seat. Yes, dude. Don't rush me. Fuck you. I'm ready now. 
Oh, wow. Yo, I would not be down for this if I were Simon. Fuck that. That's his name, right, Simon? All right, let me just get this out of the way. You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. Toronto, Canada, David Munchie. Born 1988, July 16th. Right. Oh shit, that's my birthday. Version what the fuck? <laughs> Good. I mean, like All the day well, this hurt. and the month, not scan. the year. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. That's so. Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? Say cheese. Oh. I could hear that, like I could feel that in my headphones. That felt really weird. It was this, I was getting scanned too. But seriously though, that guy has the same birthday as me. That's awesome. Cancer the crab, yo. What happened? Hello? Mr. Munchie? Ugh. Did something go wrong? This isn't funny. This room looks significantly larger, at least the ceiling. I, I'm not supposed to put myself in... <clears throat> this is kind of stressing me out. Yeah, no fucking kidding, dude. Hey! Anyone? Hello? Hello? Am I like, oh. Oh, yeah, okay, I sh you know, that makes sense, like, trying to get up and shit and trying to move. This room's different. Oh, fuck, there I go jumping again. Oh, my. Oh, okay. Oh. What is this place? How did I get here? These are cool. Figure this out. I just need to stay calm. The fuck is this shit? No need to make things worse. Why is there blood? I just want to go home. Fuck this mug. Fuck that shit. and shit? Oh. I guess I, like... Okay. Omnitool chip starter. Build, shape, and optimize your Omnitool with fully customized tools and assistance. Alright, so, like... I guess I need to find an Omni tool? Or... Meh. Am I like, being a total idiot about this? Over here. What is this shit? Am I supposed to be hurrying? <laughs> because, like, that's really creepy. <laughs> All right. Okay. What is this? Okay. So I'm supposed to unlock it from the terminal, but the terminal is over here, and I need an Omni tool. 
to access it, but economy tool. Oh my god. <laughs> Should I just smash this? Question mark? That seems like an option. Let me get the heaviest thing I can find. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Hooray me. I don't... Uh, okay. That's ominous as fuck. I don't much appreciate this at all. <laughs> oh, spooky scary. What the f oh, It's working better than expected. Uh, They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Call Permaseal as many as you can, rather than take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock off the comp center. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll get you the data safe and safe. How did I do that? That was sufficiently creepy. What is this? What is anything? just the fanciest fridge I've ever seen. It's actually really neat. Curry mix. That's fancy. I like curry. Munch print. Is that like a replicator? So this looks like a very um, basic kitchenette for I don't know who. No bathrooms! Yay! Let's go potty! There's flies, lovely. Oh, I can take, oh, I thought I could take the towel. Is that soap? Or is that like a flask? What ifs? Meh. Locked, of course. Robot dog, great. We're headed toward the robot dog. Did I don't I guess that was me? I don't know, that was a really scary noise. Just like cower here forever and not move ever. And it looks like that's where I gotta go. Okay. Awesome. Get the shit out of my way. Yo, why the fuck is everything so dark? I mean, it's supposed to be scary, but like, fuck that. But yeah, I've uh, played some frictional games before. I haven't played Amnesia its entirety. It just really... It didn't keep my attention, like, number it did. I don't know. I think just the setting and simplicity of Penumbra. I think Black Plague was my favorite. Um, because it just, it, or no, Overture is my favorite because it was the first and it just felt so much like the thing, which is the best movie ever. Talking to me? Why are you like this? You want some structure, John?
I was just gonna play it again. Hey you. Can you talk? But yeah, it's just like These noises are very off-putting. is all of this. Over here, what's over here? Nothing. Can I like run? Oh yes, I can. That's oh, that's that's just fucking delightful. Because I can run means I will have to run at some point. Oh jeez. Uh -huh. What's in here? Oh my god. I don't want to move ever. <laughs> oh, dear lord. Oh, fuck. Is there something in here, dude? Or is it behind that door that I was about to go into? Alright, so I'm too conditioned by Dead Space, like all these little glowy shits, like they don't mean shit, probably, but I feel the need to go after them, as I feel like they are items, but, you know. even going down here? Like, should I go through that door? I don't like that door. That door is fucking spooky. It was creepy, yo. Oh, fuck. I don't have an Omni tool. Uh, I really absolutely more than anything love being scared and like just creeped out but frictional games really just has the ability to like get in my head and really fucking freak me out and i just more than anything love that they like don't arm you with anything like you don't have any weapons or tools in which to defend yourself all right so i'm like still like creeping around because they told me to creep around Alright. That's where I gotta go. Put it back. Oops. Alright, and uh, I think I'll cut it here. I don't want to get too, too far. So thanks again for sitting with me while I play. Um, I will see you guys again on the next episode. Bye.